Hi everyone, this is Superintendent of Schools Curtis Coates with our weekly update here in the Goshen School District. I'd like to start with a great big congratulations to all of our fall sport athletes. As we wind down the season at both our modified and junior varsity and varsity levels, I'd like to say how wonderful it has been to see all of our students out there competing and showing their best as they go out and work hard on behalf of all the sports that they represent and on behalf of the schools in the district here in Goshen. I'd also like to bring to the community's attention uh, at this upcoming Board of Education meeting on Monday, November 6th, the board will be holding a public hearing to debate the volunteer firefighter and volunteer ambulance tax exemption for those volunteers in the community that are homeowners. This is a new law passed by Governor Hochul that allows for those volunteers that own their own property and serve as volunteers going back to the community to apply for this exemption. The board will be delivering that and making a decision on it in the very near future. I invite those either to tune in online or to come to the meeting that are interested. A couple of reminders of important dates coming up. On November 7th, this upcoming Tuesday, November 7th, there will be a professional development day in the district. There will be no classes. On November 8th, we will have our World Language Honor Society at Goshen High School for our new inductees. Friday the 10th will be a Veterans Day, and this will be closed that day as we celebrate and honor all of the veterans that have served our countries. And uh, on November 16th, we will have our Goshen uh, High School National Honor Society induction in the high school auditorium. Look forward to congratulating all of our new inductees. Lots of exciting things going on here in the district. Please also check out our district calendar online. If you want to see anything else, always come and support our gladiators. Thanks so much, everyone, and have a great week.